We are playing matchmakers this Valentine's Day. We have our suitor, his name is Mitch, and we've just snuck up to his work. We're gonna go in there and check him out when he's all greasy and also find out what his work makes think of him. We're gonna get a Mitch pitch. Yeah, we are. So Mitch, since Monday, uh, the whole of the Illawarra knows that you're looking for love. Yep. All right, what's the feedback been from, for you personally? Uh, you know, I've got a lot of good words from mates and family members. They're all excited for me. A lot of people are wishing me the best of luck, so yeah see how things turn out. When it comes to love, okay, your relationships in the past, have you had some, some big ones, some short ones? How's it, how's it gone for you? Yeah, a couple of midterm, one long, you know, I haven't really been dating that many people. It's hard to find people these days, so. I, I get the impression from looking at you, there's been a heart broken at one point. There has, there has. Uh, everybody's got that heartbreak story. Call me the heartbreak kid. Oh, oh, they call you the yeah, heartbreak kid. Oh, oh, poor bitch. <laughs> The heartbreak, kid. Oh, no, we want, to, we want to rectify that. We want to call you Mr. Loverboy or the Casanova or something like that. We're hoping we can rectify this all on Valentine's Day. Uh, you say that they call you the heartbreak break kid, but we're at your work, and I can even see some of your work colleagues out of the corner of my eye at the moment. They're having a good giggle at your expense. They always do. We should find out a bit more about you from them, yeah, I reckon. Let's do it. Welcome. Tanya. Hello. How's it going? It's good. All right, look, we want to find out more about Mitch, from people who know Mitch very well. That's okay, right. So you work with Mitch. How, how long have you known Mitch? Oh, Mitch walked into this very office in 2012 oh, when okay. he was just 17. Did he have a moustache then as well? <laughs> he did not, but he did have long flowing locks oh, then too. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah. Well, okay, well, you, it's safe to say you know Mitch pretty well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tell us a little bit about him. We want the juicy on, goss. Come on. Come on. <laughs> come on. In short, Mitch is a very nice guy. He actually wears his heart on his sleeve. So you might come in at the end of the day and see him covered in grease to his elbows and on his face. But if even if it's been a long, hard day, if you say to him, let's go out here, he'll do anything for you. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah. Okay, so you, you know him really well. Who do you think he should date? What sort of woman? Um, he wants a caring woman. He wants, he loves love, and love as in just someone that cares about him the most. He, he loves that. He doesn't want someone out too outspoken. He just wants someone just casual. Yeah. yeah okay. Okay. So he's looking for a yeah. good, down-to-earth girl yes, down who who's just looking for a nice guy to spend some time with and have a bit of fun with. Anything else he's done a bit outrageous? He's run through a shed for a deer. What, what do you mean, run through a shed? A closed shed, steel shed, straight through it. Oh, jeez. <laughs> and then jumped in the lake. Ah. All right. Okay. Okay. So he's uh, look. We're we're liking the picture that you're painted here. And and last thing, uh, uh, you know, uh, as an employee, it, you know, he, he's a great guy to have around the place. He's amazing. He does his job. He's serious when he has to be serious. He's serious with his relationship when he has to. He's good. He knows when to be serious, when to have fun. So he's he's very very nice. All right, Chris, good on you, man. Thanks for million. Thanks. All right, there you go. Mitch is one hell of a guy. Mm -hmm. If you're looking for love right now, make sure you jump on wavefm.com.au and register. Tell your friends as well. He's a cool dude, I reckon. He certainly is, and a lot of fun to boot, and dearly loved, so he could be the guy for you.